This video is on how to make tax payment using ePay tax functionality on the e-filing portal. Presently, the taxpayers can make tax payment either using NSDL portal or ePay tax facility on the e-filing portal. ePay tax facility is a new functionality on the e-filing portal where the entire chain of activities related to payment of income tax, that is generation of Chalan form, making tax payment and recording the payment history are available on the portal itself. The facility is presently enabled for selected authorized banks. This is in addition to the existing tax payment facility through NSDL portal. In this video, we will see how do we use ePay tax functionality on the e-filing portal for the purpose of generating Chalan form and for the purpose of making tax payment through different modes that is net banking, debit card, over-the-counter, NEFT, RTGS and payment gateway. ePay tax facility is available both in the pre-login as well as post-login mode. To access the tax payment facility in the pre-login mode, you should have a valid and active PAN or TAN number and any valid mobile number. To access the facility post-login, you should be a registered user on the e-filing portal. Let us now look at step-by-step -step how to make the tax payment in the post-login mode. You are required to first of all log into the e-filing portal with your user ID and password. Post login on your dashboard, click on e-file and go to e-pay tax. On the e-pay tax page, you can view the details of saved drafts, generated chalans and the payment history. For making a new payment, you can click on new payment where you can make the payment through net banking, debit card, over the counter, NEFT, RTGS, payment gateway for the selected authorized banks. However, if you wish to access the tax payment pages of other banks, you can click here to go to NSDL. On the new payment page, you can select the payment tile which is applicable to you. If you wish to find your tax payment category, you can click on find your tax payment category and then click on proceed button. After selecting the applicable tax payment tile, you are required to enter the relevant details of assessment year and the type of payment that is the minor head and then click on continue button. Here you are required to add the tax breakup details. You can add the breakup of total amount of tax payment and then click on continue button. You will be able to access the various modes for the payment of taxes that is net banking, debit card, pay at bank counter, RTGS, NEFT or payment gateway. You can select the payment mode through which you wish to make the payment. Please note that the taxpayers having bank account with an authorized bank can only use net banking mode of payment. No transaction charges or fees applicable for making payments through net banking. Let us now look at the steps for making payment through net banking mode. After selecting the mode of payment as net banking you can choose the authorized bank name however if you wish to use the net banking facility for other banks you can click payment gateway and then use net banking of other banks as well after selecting the bank you click on continue button here you can preview the tax details and then click on pay now to make the tax payment you would be required to accept the terms and conditions and then click on submit to bank once you click on submit to bank, you will be redirected to the website of selected bank where you can click on pay and enter your user ID and password and then log into the bank page to make the tax payment. After successful payment, a success message will be displayed on the e-filing portal. You can download the Chalan receipt for future reference. You will be able to view the details of payment made in the payment history menu on the ePay tax page. Now, if you want to make the payment through debit card, you can select the mode of payment as debit card and then select the bank name from the options and click on continue button. Again, this mode is available only for authorized banks offering collection through their own debit card. For other banks debit card, you may select the payment gateway mode. You can preview and make the payment. You can verify the payment details and then click on pay now. Again, you are required to accept the terms and conditions and then click on submit to bank. Once the Chalan will be paid, you will be able to see a success message. You can download the Chalan receipt for future reference and the details are also available in the payment history menu on the ePay tax page. If you wish to make the payment at the bank counter, you can select the mode of payment as pay at bank counter and then select whether you would like to make the payment through cash check or demand draft you are then required to select the authorized bank and click on continue button please note that pay at bank counter option is also available for authorized banks only if you choose cash as a mode of payment in pay at bank counter option please note 
that the tax payment of not more than rupees 10000 in cash is allowed however there will not be any transaction charges or fee which will be applicable for making payment through this mode you can also make the payment through check and through demand draft please make sure that while you approach the bank you should have a signed copy of the chalan form along with the payment instrument to make the payment either through check or through demand you are required to visit the bank branch to make the payment along with the successfully generated chalan form with the chalan reference number once the payment is made the bank will share the copy of the acknowledgement if you wish to make the payment through rtgs or any ft mode you can select the mode of payment and then click on continue button here you would be required to create a chalan form along with a mandate form take a printout of the same and then visit the bank's website or branch please note that bank charges will be applicable as per the terms and conditions prescribed by the respective originator bank you can preview and download the mandate form verify the payment details and then click on continue button you can see that on a successfully generated mandate form there will be a chalan reference number you can visit the bank branch along with the mandate form or make the payment of tax using net banking facility of the bank where you have an account please note that any ft rtgs payments can be made through any bank you are advised to confirm the availability of any ft rtgs facility with your bank another option for making the tax payment is the payment gateway mode you can select the payment gateway mode and then click on continue button in this mode you can make the payment by net banking and debit card of any bank please note that payment gateway charges may be applicable you are advised to compare the transaction charges before selecting the payment gateway mode and the payment option you can check the tax breakup details verify the payment details and then click on pay now please agree to the terms and conditions and then click on submit to bank you would be redirected to the website of the selected payment gateway where you can log in or enter your debit card credit card or upi details and make the tax payment on successful payment a success message will be displayed you can download the chalan receipt for future reference however the details will also be available in the payment history menu on the ePay tax page. Let us now look at the steps to create Chalan in the pre-login mode. If you wish to make the tax payment in the pre-login mode, you are required to visit the e-filing portal homepage and click on ePay tax in the quick links section. On reaching ePay tax page, you are required to enter either your PAN or your TAN number and re-enter it to confirm the PAN TAN and then enter the mobile number and click on continue button. An OTP will be sent on your mobile number. You can enter the six digit OTP received and then click on continue. Post OTP verification, a success message with entered PAN TAN and name will be displayed. You're required to click on the continue button. Here you can select the tile which is applicable on you and then click on proceed button. Depending on the category, you will be able to select from the following payment categories. The TAN users will be able to select pay TDS TCS. Depending on the category of PAN of the taxpayer, you would be able to select whether income tax or corporation tax is applicable to you. After creating the Chalan form, you are required to follow the same steps as we have already discussed in the post login mode. Please note that here you cannot save the Chalan in the pre-login mode. In order to save the Chalan, you will have to log in and then make the payment of your taxes. Making payment of taxes on the e-filing portal is very easy. For more information, please visit www.incometax.gov.in or contact our helpline numbers.